Hello everybody, welcome back to State of Decay 2 with me, Flick. I have to switch the controller. I couldn't find any information on how to fix the weird not locking in issue we have. So I'm just learning the buttons. Some That's flashlight, okay. That's jump. What's crouch? B? B is crouch. Manage storage for now. I want to... I want to put stuff in. Protected storage. I don't know how to like store the crap in my backpack. What is the backpack button anyway? No, oh, there's attack. And that's aim, okay. What's inventory? Ow. Probably shouldn't have done that. Uh, where is, is the control listing for? I just want to know what inventory is, really. Flashlight is, yeah, we know that one. Interact is Y. Ah, inventory. Toggle inventory panel, it isn't mapped. I guess character panel will have to do, right? There we go, that's everything. Yeah, I wanna know how to store this crap. Surely you do that in storage. Hey Rockstar, wasting his arms today? Press A to climb over obstacles. There's gotta be a store passives. Sort ammo withdraw rucksack. No, I don't want that. My blinders are just not a way to put in storage. Scrap materials for parts. Probably shouldn't have done that. Press Y to interact. Ah, there we go. That's what I wanted. Open supply locker. Store. Uh, store. 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 You have more spaces. Yes, you do. All right. So now I need to get three storage supply thingies to make the infirmary because I accidentally just scrapped one. My bad. What is the map button? Right click. Okay, so nearest place to go to potential resources. We'll go to there and we'll see what we can find. And the marker is over there. What a sprint. Almost out of those. There, sprint. So that's something we passed on the way in. Don't worry, I'm sure that zombie I just passed won't mind me just ignoring him. So it's right trigger plus X to oh, stealth kill. Like this place. It's a dilapidated shack. What is there to like? Whoa, check this out. So it's a noisemaker boombox. Yeah, place decoy. This one's obviously where we can risk it. That'll bring him running. Oh, it appears it actually spawns zombies. I don't know if I fully explored it or not. Alright, now that I know doing that spawns zombies, it's probably not something I'll do at any point. I thought it just alerted nearby ones. Okay, let's head down there and check that little gate thing. It, looks, it sounds like they lost interest anyway. The zombies have a worse cardio stat than I do. Speaking of which. Well, this is a construction site, so surely this is going to have what I need. Oh, this could have been a home base as well. Weird. Alright, so as you fill in the map, it looks like... Dalton was out? She found painkillers. Ooh, a Molotov. I 
I don't remember saying the doctor could go out. We need her. Ooh. Sure, I'll use that for a little while. I also want to make sure I've got the buttons down. So it was right trigger plus X. Okay, good. Dirty bird espresso? Excuse me? Oh, you can make this little pathetic sack your... Shack, rather, your uh, base. Okay, so I've got myself a storage increase, I guess? Oh. I accidentally found the radial commands. Oh, wait, no, it's a satchel flower. So that's for food. Okay. It's not what I'm okay. after right now, though. Looks empty. Let's move on. Yeah, here's where I can probably get what I need to make the infirmary for dumb friend. Hopefully. That's the main goal here. You know, to stop him dying in junk. Portable generator? Oh, I can't take that as well as the flower, eh? Okay, I'm going to have to come back for that. Probably a lot of stuff here. Apparently, oh wow, I think you can climb that to scout the area or something. Claim outpost. No, I don't want to claim outpost. I want to raid it for supplies. And then maybe look around the area. Uh, our stash of building materials is getting very low. I know. I'm working on it. It's been ten minutes. If that. You can see me if you look out the window. So there's a couple of stores there as well, but there's probably a lot more to grab here. I'd like the portable generator in case we can do some kind of, like, turrets or something. Okay, so this is a very, very big tower. There's another one in the distance, actually. Aim to enter survey mode. Armor tanker? So I remember this mechanic from the first one. It's coming back to me now. How to fill in your map. I just spotted some wheels we should check out. A lot of stuff to search. Okay, plague heart in sight. Oh, swine and bovine plague heart. I understand some of those words. Oh, we could do a lot with that place. Could we? Oh, it's a farm. I see. Okay, I don't see any other question marks for me. Oh wait, no, never mind. There is a bunch. Okay, nothing more to see here. Unfinished house. That'd be bus uh, business supplies, building supplies as well. Now surely I could do a fast one up here and not spawn zombies. Where should I put this? Ah, oh, some ammo that I can't take. I'm just gonna drop the boom box and take the ammo because the ammo feels like it's more useful to me. All right, we'll take back this food so we can grab the portable generator, take that back, and then hopefully find what I'm actually after. Because if I can't find building supplies in the construction, well, it's not really a construction site, is it? It's a, like, storage thingy. If there is a slide down ladder button, I would like the game to tell me quickly. Maybe B? Oh, there is! I had to find it my own. I wasn't willing to risk testing until I was a bit closer to the ground. Right, let's get these supplies in. Run, man, run. <laughs> what a half-hearted jump he's got. Oh, you can park a car there. Oops. Need more food Don't jump over the edge, <sighs> you madman. You need more food? Well, have I got a surprise for you. Also, it's way too dark in here. We probably do need that generator. This should do us for a while. So I got influence for doing that. And we're going to store that, store that, store that, store that, store that, store that. And store that, because I don't really need the ammo for now, because we're just fighting normal zombies. 
Can I do anything with this garden? It's pre-built. Costs two for 50 seconds. Two what? Oh, two people. So now, like, the two people who are here can clear the trash so we can have our garden. Right, right, right. That gives me time to quickly go on another run across the road. I keep on wanting to press down on the left stick to run, and that's the turn flashlight on and off button. I believe you can only claim one side at a time, so that's why I'm not claiming the little espresso shop. Did I did I take it? If I did, why is it not on my back? Oh, I see the zombie. It's a little hard to see, but I can see it. I might have to up the brightness a little bit. Toolkit. Repair vehicle. Greasy automotive magazine. Extraordinary trade value, eh? Yeah, let's up the brightness just a little bit. The game does not pause when I'm in here. Just gamma. It's probably going to be too bright now at night. Uh, day, rather, but... Had to be done. Building supplies, please. More f oh, wait, no, that is the one I want. Excellent. Now, is there another one? You're encumbered. Strenuous activity costs more stamina. In other words, fighting, climbing, running, everything. Ooh. I wonder how many this is classed as holding. Okay, so there might be stuff on the roofs, but for now, that's everything that can be explored, I think. Let's see how much my stamina goes down just from climbing this wall. Eh, it didn't seem that much more. Oh, that's draining twice as fast, though. Yeah, sprinting is twice as hard. Oh, we can talk to Dalton while we're in. Hey, cardio three star. You ever feel guilty about wanting to go back out there? So you can switch about to Morrison if you want. Kill He's good at killing things. Skills and advanced facilities. Nice. Anyone can build simple facilities for advanced facilities and upgrade your new survivors with special perks. It's a very thing we've done. I'm here and getting started. Oh, right, Sweet. so we had enough. Excellent, let's build the infirmary. We'll build it, I guess, just over here. Build facility. Build an infirmary. Oh, it just kind of appeared on me. What about this? Still? Wasn't this a garden? Every survivor carries a radio they can call for outside support if you need resources or recruit. Yeah, so if we need someone to come collect stuff for us, we can radio people. That was in the first one as well. Oh, didn't we find fuel? I think we could totally refuel. I'm just making sure all the sites are clear, and they are. What other facilities could we build? A workshop, a kitchen. Well, we have a kitchen inside this building, don't we? Outdoor beds, a still, a garden. A garden might be a good idea, but we need five. Okay. What can I do with this generator I got? Do we not have any lights on in here? Don't worry, I'm not contagious. Yet. Portable generator. As long as we have gas, we have power. Install this mod and supply it with fuel to a single facility. I see. Store that for now. Store that. Store that. The car does not need repaired, it needs petrol. And we have it. So let's do that. Let's dump the generator for now then, because I don't have any facilities built. The infirmary might need powered once it's built. So we'll just hold on to that for now. Traveling light. Yeah. Okay. Let's go grab that. Oh, lights did come on. It just took a while. Oh, wait, no. It's candles. Ha! <laughs> Fair enough. Do I need to put in, like, a build order? Enact rationing. No, I don't want rationing. Prepare feasts. Can't do that either. Make consumables, collect seats. No. 
Oh, there's how you can mod it. So provides power with fuel. Use fuel to power the facility. I don't know if we need to do that yet, is the thing. So I, I'll wait for the game to tell me, because maybe I think that generator was a lucky find. So I'm going to hold off, but I will go back up and get the car. So the car is... Where did we come in from? Was it up there? It must have been from there, right? Or was it up there? No, it was. It was there. It was somewhere up there. It's a car that's just sitting there that we can refuel. Yes, thank you. I did remember to stock up. I don't feel like I came down from this way, though, did I? Because I feel like I saw the building side on, but at the same time... Yeah, I came from this way. I definitely came from this way. Oh, there it is. Yep, totally looking in the wrong direction. I hope nastier things don't come out at night. And we might as well grab some supplies while we're going. I think I fully checked up there. It's grey on the map, so let's have a look and see if there's anything here. I can barely see that zombie. Christ. There's actually two of them. And they're both facing opposite directions, which makes it very hard to stealth kill them. Kind of waiting and hoping that she's going to turn. She ain't. She's coming this way. Of course she is. I can kill the other one normally if need be. been here all along. Even though it's very, very dark. Ooh, an X. Sounds important. Yeah, so lethality isn't actually that high. Ease of use is high though, so you don't need a high combat skill to use it effectively. What is this? I thought it was a dead, like, jaguar or something. What do we have here? Four containers to search, potential resources, supplies, and food. Or like, that's just normal scrap or something, right? Me? Oh, you shouldn't have. Well, there's food, ethanol, energy drink. I guess I'll take the food. I mean, food never goes... I was going to say food never goes bad. That's literally not true. But <laughs> and what I mean is it's never not needed, let's say. Box of seats. So I can upgrade my farming, I think that's it. I'll read it properly once we're safe, because I don't like sitting in almost perpetual darkness reading tutorials when the game doesn't pause. There's some more seeds. Use for upgrading guard. Yeah, okay, that's what it's for. Apparently there's one more container here I haven't checked. It's the water tower? What a weird thing to search. I guess you just have a 100% chance of getting some water from this. Hey, that, oh wait, that was petrol. Oh, okay. I don't think I need to worry about having the light on because I don't think zombies react to the light. Yeah, he doesn't care. Citizen Hunter has increased in standing. Oh, because the infirmary finished. Nice. Once you give me the go -ahead, I can start treating Why do I have to give you the go-ahead? If you don't, he'll turn into a zombie and kill you. Where should I put this? In your pants. Gonna have to get more of those. I just made him use the energy drink just for the space, honestly. Alright, let's get back then. Let's grab this car and get out of here. This is way too dark. I mean, it's supposed to be, I guess. Maybe you can get more powerful flashlights. I know I'm running past the zombie and the zombie, but whatever. Oh, I actually got two of them after me. It does need repaired? I thought it just needed fuel. Don't mess with me. Oh, I had a bunch of supplies. 
I hear horrible things. So I do need to bring the repair kit. She said it needed fuel. Fuel, damn it, fuel! And there's things I just dropped. The doctor lied to me. All right, I'll bring. I'm coming back for this car. I want this car. And now that I know what supplies are in the trunk. Jesus, I can't see a damn thing. I'll probably sleep till daytime as well once we're back in the base. I mean, it's not too far. We have killed most of the zombies here. Remember rightly, it was specifically like coffee that gives you maximum stamina increase or something? Yeah, don't mind me, gents. Or ladies, you know, whatever. It's hard to tell where my base is because apparently the candles aren't on. Since one of them is still chasing me, I'm just going to go around the back and hope that it kind of loses interest. Hey, I think it did. I don't think I can go much longer without a rest. Oh, that's right. Their maximum stamina and crap goes down, doesn't it? Stabilize blood plague. This isn't as good as having the actual cure, but I should be able to keep his blood plague. It halts the progress until you can get the cure. That is, if we can keep our supply of meds from running out. Hey, I was just going to say, it sounds like they broke in. Hello. I see you folks are my new neighbors. Oh. Could one of you come by to help me out with something? Whoever that is, they probably know a lot about this area. We could use a friend like that. See if they can help us find more meds. We need them to treat our patient until we can make the cure. Okay, but I need to get the car first. So... I'll keep one petrol on me in case the game tries to screw me over with that. So, store that. Where is the vehicle repair kit? Walking up to the front of the vehicle and interacting with it. Yes. Human enclaves. The frontier is inhabited by small enclaves of human survivors. If you're helpful, they become allies, trading partners, or recruits. Ignore or betray them, and they can become hostile. Okay. Is there even beds here? I might need to build beds. Command center. Interact with each of the facilities to find out what they do. Opens base screen. Okay. View beds. Ah, there's change characters. Right. Why would you feel a bedroom? What advantage does that give you? View beds. So I could change to Morrison, but I'd like to get this car thing done and then we can maybe change to him when we go somewhere and meet Crystal. I don't know if he's as personable as whatever the name is of the person I'm playing as right now. I can't see a damn thing. How can night be getting darker? It's peak night. At least we'll be coming back in style. Oh, there's more zombies here. Than there was like 15 seconds ago. They did not climb the fence. Good. I just have to take my word for it if YouTube's darkened it even further. I mean, I can barely see at the moment. Here is zombie behind here somewhere. I don't see it though. Oh, there it is. He's closer than I thought. It needs more than one repair kit. Are you absolutely shitting me? Uh, no. Arg. Arg. Wait, it's got one in it. Alright, now I'm glad I still went back because one is not enough. Pilato CR needs no repairs. Oh, it needs it did need fuel.
then I'm double glad. Although it did have a repair kit on it and it did only need one, but shut up, that's why. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Whoa, wait, I can grab those things I left. I like the ambient music, it's a little bit Silent Hilly. The wooden bat was broken, but whatever, the bandage might be important. B for handbrake, got it. Hey, I can see. The car handling is a lot better than in the first one. So that means the car is claimed by us, if it's part of one of these special looking spaces, I believe. You can upgrade it too. It's new. To keep this place running, we need more fuel. Could you be more specific than fuel? Do you mean fuel for our bodies? Fuel for a generator? Where the hell did they come from? All right, we're doing this. This is my car. You can't have it. Get lost. That one's very fast. It looks like a hunter. No one else will just defend the homestead. I will. Right, food is not going to be an issue for a while. I would like to close this gate though. Keep the zombies out. Alright, get stored. Out of food storage? You don't have enough space for any more food. That means this will decay if you don't use it soon. Alright. Can we use some of it to make like a proper fancy ass How meal? Can we just watch someone die when there's a cure out there? We're not watching him die. You need knowledge of cooking. That's going to use, what, one food? In one second? Sure. Just so it's not going to waste, you know. So, we will get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of the petrol, get rid of the repair kit. You are good to have your well-earned sleep, I feel. And we'll switch to Morrison. And hopefully there'll be some passage of time when I sleep. Change characters. So he's not available because he's dying. <laughs> he's She's not available because she's story centric. So really we only have these two. Hunter and Morrison. Show details. You've got more HP than me. More stamina as well I think. Cardia, your cardio is way... Oh he's just really really good. good. And his sarcastic skill is sewing. Time does not appear to have fast forwarded at all. I can't see what... Oh, there we are. Hello, I'm me. Have your well-earned sleep, my friend. Can I build, like, a generator room or something just to get some lights? It's got to be something you can do. Anyway, he has a proper rifle, right? Oh, yeah, he's got himself a sniper of some kind. What is that? Arctic Warrior. Hmm. And it can be silenced by looks. He's got a crowbar, which is fine... We shall take some heals. Actually, if we have an abundance of... If we don't find more ammo, these guns are going to become fancy doorstops. Four bags of snacks added to inventory. That's fine. I hear a zombie breaking in somewhere. How are you getting in? Oh, you're not a zombie. Hello, doctor. Good idea. I don't want outdoor beds, stills, gardens, gym, shooting range, latrine, rain collector, generator. Electrical lights via power. It needs five of the like crafting resources. There's no way I can do that right now. 
How close is this person? She, oh, she's up at the house I already checked. No, wait, no, I don't think I headed in that direction. God, we're just heading out into the pitch black and there's a zombie right there. Community needs appear in the upper left corner of the screen when inventory is open. So we are going to end soon here, but I want to see if we can get this neighbor helped out first of all real quick. I apologize that the nighttime is just so pitch black, but there's not much. I mean, I can try putting up the brightness again, I guess. Scraps of circuit train parts. Hmm. Did I just accidentally get his attention by doing that? Nope. Oh, there's a blood zombie in front of me. I mean, I just boosted it by a lot there. I don't want you to see me. I also don't want you to touch me, so I might have to use my gun if you do see me. Basically, just really watch out for the ones with red eyes. Be extra, extra cautious, just in case. A lack of storage meant some supplies got ruined, so I lost food that quickly. Minus three food. Okay. Sounds like you're fighting with zombies in there. Hmm. Locked. Damn. Too loud. Crystal. Crystal. Are you dead? I hear, I hear the pitter patter of. Oh, there you are. Hello. Hello. No, oh, she's very polite. I don't know if you noticed, but we have a lot of zombies infesting a building nearby. We'd both be safer if you help me clear it out. Sure. Of course. Infestations. Infestations like this are pretty dangerous. Kill the screamer. If you need some extra ammunition, I have a few rounds to spare. If you don't clear out infestations now and again, they spread all over. Then they become a serious problem. Got it. Uh, trade with Enclave? So, what have you got to trade? Of course. She has 22 caliber rounds, but I don't use those. That's all right. Am I allowed to like look through your things, or is that does that count as like theft? Where's the abandoned clinic? Oh, there. If she tells me off, I'll stop. Nothing here. Oh, did she tell me? Did she not tell me off because there was nothing, or? Oh, there's a pistol. I can't carry that. Don't know what that means there. Can I like radio someone and tell them to come here and Is anyone out there? I could use a little help. Someone nearby needs your help. Um, I ain't seen the question mark. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. God, there's a lot of things to do. All right, we're gonna have to do a break there because this could be a little bit time consuming. I don't know how often this game saves. That's an unfortunate little side effect. Ooh. No more room. How do I like? I want to use it. But did I lose my... God, every button except the one I want. Oh no, I kept it. Good. See, I'm not sure when it saves. But either way, we will call this one there. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully we'll be able to see a bit better next time when it becomes daytime. Until next time, ta-ta for now.